Bounty hunting is a complicated profession. Don't you agree? Hey there, guys and gals. I am that 80s nostalgic toy guy. Thank you very much for joining me at the collector's table once again today. For today, we are unboxing and going over my very first star wars the black series figure this is hasbro's current major uh line of toys coming out in celebration of one of our favorite toy lines vintage and new the star wars brand and i have a lot of these star wars the black series figures so this is just the first of many on the channel we're going to go over unbox and have fun with and add to my collection so before I get moving forward and going over the box art of this number 94 Star Wars The Mandalorian figure here from the Black Series by Hasbro. So before we get to the box art on this and the unboxing and articulation of this awesome Mandalorian piece, go ahead and hit like on this video for me, please. I really would appreciate that. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't subscribed to the channel. I'd absolutely love to have you on board. And then hit the notification bell. That way you don't miss out on future Star Wars videos. Uh, the Black Series unboxings, Hasbro videos and unboxings, including newer stuff and vintage stuff. Got tons of Hasbro vintage toys and collectibles to go over. Now on to Hasbro's The Black Series Star Wars, the box art, unboxing, and articulation of Mandalorian. You see a lot of awesome stuff on here. You see the awesome black and red. I love that color scheme. We also see the Star Wars logo, the Black Series logo, the Mandalorian logo, the Hasbro logo. This figure says 4 plus. I tell you what, I know that I am 4 plus years old. Uh, you have to add some, uh, some other numbers on there to get my age. But this thing is made for all kids ages 4 and up. And I certainly fit that bill. We see that number 94 on there, the Mandalorian logo. We see some information on the back about the Mandalorian. Just absolutely amazing. Uh, lots of stuff going on well for this, the Black Series box art. And then to finish it up, we see the Mandalorian in that open face box. Look at what we got in there. Let's go open him up and get him out of the box. This is the regular, the Mandalorian figure, not to be confused with the best car armor mandalorian figure which we will be going over in a future unboxing review video so make sure you hit notifications for that let's go ahead and get this box off this awesome the mandalorian figure we're going to go ahead and just pop this mandalorian figure out just like that we're going to pull him out and let you see him firsthand right there that first look at this totally awesome the Mandalorian figure from the Black Series here by Hasbro. Look at that awesome figure. Look at those two accessories. Look at all that armor. Let's go ahead, pull him the rest of the way out of there. We're going to go over this Mandalorian figure as he spins around there. We see that awesome, awesome Mandalorian helmet. And all that brown and like light gray uh, of his front armor. The cloth of that too. The stuff that's supposed to be metal and stuff that's supposed to be cloth. So as we're coming around here to the side, we see some really cool, um, like really cool detail on the helmet and just the character himself. Just a really amazing uh, figure here. The Black Series actually, I think, is a really cool series of figures. And they do a really amazing job with their figures. And I, I just can't wait to unbox more and get myself a display set up for these figures. We go ahead, we open up this figure, we go around. We see, as we're going over him, we see more of that armor, that brown armor over his shoulders. Look at that, it's got that, that battle damage on there. He's got those weapons there on his wrists. That blue uh, triangle piece there, the Mandalorian has there on his gloves there. I absolutely love that. We go down the side here and we see this awesome stuff where all his ammo and stuff he holds. Look really closely as he spins around here. He's got ammo all over him, even down to his shin down there, there's ammo. So we're gonna do one more spin here as we look over that robe there on the back side there. You can also see down there, see his, his boots down there, a little bit different coloration than the rest of his pants. Looks really nice. Got that cool little brown striper on his left, uh, left ankle, left calf area. And as you can see, as he turns around, he's got <clears throat> on his, um, his belt there, he's got like detonators and uh, tracking fobs and all that stuff around his waist. And all that armor that goes down his legs. Again, you see more ammo and everything down there on that right side there ammo ammo everywhere you see ammo and then we see right there the holster it's going to holster this weapon that he has 
the weapon being this blaster pistol right here that he can actually hold in his hand or put inside that holster. And then he's got this awesomely made blaster rifle. Look at that thing. Looks really absolutely amazing. Get a little bit closer there, you'll see. Look at all that little detail there. For, you know, a $20 figure, this is actually not that bad of a price point. Uh, looks like it's got a little little piece right there that sticks onto him. I bet you that sticks onto his back. Uh, we see a spot there on the back. Like I said, for that rifle, we're going to put that on there. We see that this holster is a fully operational holster. As you pop this out of here, we can actually put that pistol inside that, that uh, holster. Or his hands are set up to hold, so he can actually hold these pistols, these uh these rifles, all of his weapons. So, articulation-wise, awesome movement there at the head. Look, he's going crazy, awesome movement at the head. Great movement at the shoulders. We have awesome articulation. I love this joint here at that elbow. We got some swivel motion there at this uh, this uh, weapon right here. It's on his, his, uh, his forearm. And then we got some nice movement at the wrist, in and out, in and around, which is pretty cool. He's got some awesome ab crunch movement, so he can put him in all those those favorite awesome stances from the Mandalorian streaming series on Disney Plus. And then he's got that awesome movement at the hips. And I see here he's got some swivel motion here at the top of the thigh. Oh, yeah, there, there we go. Really cool right there. I love that. He's got some great movement here at the knees. Look at that awesome joint there. And then we finish off the articulation at the feet where we go up and down, side to side, so he can stand up just like this. Now I'm going to take this rifle. And this pistol, I'm going to put him on Mandalorian, and then I'm going to bid you adieu. I wanted that pistol in his hand. I wanted to see if that trigger finger lined up with that pistol uh, trigger there, and it absolutely does. Look at that. Looks absolutely amazing. He is ready to go. You can see that finger sticking through the trigger uh, spot there. Looks absolutely amazing. Let's put the blaster rifle on, and I'm going to put that over his back. And we pop it in there just like that on his backside. You can see on his back. There's a hole there. It goes in there. It lines up just like that. Looks absolutely amazing hanging over that cape there. You see that awesome uh, trigger area there. His hand will fit over that if you want to put it in his other hand. But I want him to carry it like that. That was my first The Black Series Star Wars Hasbro unboxing. It is Mandalorian, the regular figure there. His, his first set of armor we see in that TV series there before he gets his Beskar armor which we will be going over that figure too in a future unboxing and review video. So make sure you hit the notification bell for that and other Star Wars figures and unboxings and videos, Hasbro videos, The Mandalorian videos, because I've got plenty. Go ahead and hit the like button on this video for me, please. I would appreciate that very much. Leave me some comments. Let's talk about the figure you just saw today. Let's talk about Star Wars, about Hasbro, the Black Series, and the Mandalorian. And then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, I'd love to have you on board. I would appreciate that very much. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for joining me for this, the Black Series debut for the collector's table. I am that Asian Soundtrack toy guy. I look forward to getting back to the collector's table real soon to unbox something awesome, something cool, something old, or something new. The Mandalorian just got word that Boba Fett needs a little bit of help. And I can't hold back the Mandalorian. He needs to go help. He's going to go help save the day once again. And I can't hold him back. And I've got to go myself. I'll see you back at the collector's table real soon.